Finance News Video December Welcome to the last edition of the 2022 Ants News Video. We invite you to take a glance and learn about the main events and initiatives of the Salesian world which took place in all regions during the month of December. RMG Presentation of the Strena 2023 On the 27th December 2022, the Rector Major of the Salesians of Don Bosco, Father Angel Fernandez Artime, at the Institute of the Daughters of Mary Help of Christians, presented the Strena 2023 as the yeast in today's human family, the lay dimension in the family of Don Bosco, to the Daughters of Mary Help of Christians, and the whole Salesian family. The event was attended by the Mother General of the Institute, Sister Chiara Katsuola, and her council, the Mother Emeritus, Sister Yvonne Reungot, the General Counselor for Social Communication, Father Gildasio Mendes, the Economer General of the Salesian Congregation, Brother Jean Paul Muller. The meeting began with a hymn to Mary sung by the novices which was followed by the presentation of the Strena video and then questions to the Rector Major. It was also an opportunity for Father Ángel Fernández Artime to explain the reason for choosing this theme and above all, to emphasize the complementarity between the members of the Salesian family itself with regard to the mission for young people. Press tour in the footsteps of Don Bosco. From 16th to 18th December, 30 journalists accredited to the Vatican Press Office and the Italian Foreign Press took part in the press tour in the footsteps of Don Bosco, organized by Father Giuseppe Costa, co spokesperson of the Salesian Congregation. It was an experience rich in discoveries and opportunities to admire at first hand the beauty, relevance and perennial relevance of the Salesian charism starting from the knowledge of its founder. The first activity was a press conference given by the Rector Major Father Angel Fernandez Artime who explained to them the current reality of the congregation. Afterwards, the journalists present were able to visit the various rooms of the Museo Casa Don Bosco and then continue their journey to Castel Nuovo Don Bosco. The meeting ended with the Mass in the Basilica of Mary Help of Christians, presided by the Rector of the Basilica, Father Michele Viviano, and concelebrated also by Father Gildasio Mendes, General Counselor for Social Communication, and finally the concluding Agape. Africa, Madagascar Nigeria Africa, Nigeria, Niger province celebrates provincial chapter. The first provincial chapter of the Africa, Nigeria, Niger province was held from 4th to 8th December at the provincial house in Iju, Lagos, opened by the provincial Father Jorge Crisafulli. The chapter developed the theme what solutions for the young people of Africa, Nigeria, Niger province today, which clearly refers to the theme of the 28th general chapter. During the provincial chapter, commissions were set up to discuss possible changes and suggestions for the growth of the province. 
at the end of the provincial chapter on the solemnity of the Immaculate Conception, Father Jorge Crisofoli celebrated the Eucharist as a sign of gratitude to God and in memory of the anniversary of the birth of the Salesian Oratory. Ghana, First Provincial Chapter of South Africa West The first provincial chapter of the new Salesian province of South Africa West was held from 5th to 10th December. The chapter, composed of 40 members, was an opportunity to reflect on some important documents of GC28 on the Rector Major's programmatic proposal to the Salesian congregation. All the work was conducted under the guidance of Father Chukwudi Akubuese, Provincial Chapter Moderator. The chapter was a true moment of integration for the confreres of the province and the cultural and linguistic differences did not hinder the momentum of fraternity nor the richness of the reflections and it was a true Silesian Pentecost. America, South Cone Brazil, Operation Maturaca brings donations to indigenous villages. In the last month of 2022, the third edition of Operation Maturaca took place, a project of the Rede Salesiana Brasil, in collaboration with the armed forces and various benefactors in favor of needy indigenous communities. Hundreds of items of clothing have been delivered to the most inaccessible areas of the Amazon, thanks to the generous donations of the long-standing partners of this solidarity network. Many in the community of Maturaka said they were happy and relieved to have received this donation. This project has been offering assistance to those most in need since 2018. Salesiano! Viva! East Asia, Oceania Vietnam Christmas for 5,000 differently abled people About 5,000 differently abled people from the northern provinces of Vietnam experienced moments of closeness, loving kindness and solidarity as they participated in Christmas celebrations over the weekend of 10th and 11th December at the Divine Mercy Centre in An Lac Parish, Wutu District. The participants, most of them non-Catholics, were served by nearly thousand volunteers, including religious and university students. Behind this annual gathering is Salesian Bishop Pierre Nguyen Van De, Bishop Emeritus of Thai Bin. During the gathering, participants were able to receive medicine and medical tests, take part in traditional games with prizes, cultural performances, tasted various typical dishes and attended the Mass, concelebrated by three bishops and 50 priests. Fiji, Bula Bosco 2022. 
On 17th December, more than 160 young people gathered at the Don Bosco Educational Youth Center to participate in the Bula Bosco 2022 event. The gathering was centered on the theme of the Rector Major's Strenna, Do Everything Out of Love, Nothing by Force, and was accompanied by the Suwa Center Director, Father James Kiaoho, the new parish priest, Father Taisali Liu Lai, and the Provincial of the Daughters of Mary Help of Christians in Austria Pacific, Sister Louise McKeog. The event was a wonderful opportunity for sharing, reflection, and joy for all participants. South Asia India Mumbai 50 years of luminous service On Saturday, 3rd December 2022, Feast of St. Francis Xavier, the celebrations for the Golden Jubilee, 50 years of activity of the Salesian province of India, Mumbai, of which St. Francis Xavier is the patron, reached its climax in Mumbai. The festive celebration marked by a spirit of Salesian gratitude and joy was opened in the afternoon by the solemn Eucharist presided over by Bishop Bartol Barreto, Auxiliary Bishop of the Archdiocese of Mumbai. After the Eucharist, a festive program was organized to celebrate the Golden Jubilee of the province. The artistic and cultural spectacle left the audience admire and the long-standing contribution made by the province to the entire western region of India. Guwahati, 14th National Boskori. The 14th National Boskori took place in the Assam Don Bosco University campus at Tapesia from 29th December 2022 to 3rd January 2023. Boskori takes place once in four years, and in this edition, a mammoth gathering of 3,000 scouts and guides from Silesian institutions from all over India with Don Bosco, the patron saint, and Baden Powell, the founder of Scout Movement, as mentor and inspirational icon, took place. It was conceived with an idea to bring all Don Bosco scouts and guides troops together to experience adventure, service, and to celebrate unity in diversity with one goal in mind, to be the agent of better India and the world. The six-day program was designed under the theme Save Our Planet Home, which provided lots of opportunities to young scouts and guides to experience and learn from others. Salesian Youth Movement, Europe, and the Middle East General Assembly. The Oratory of Juarun, a suburb of Zagreb, 
hosted from 2nd to 4th December the 18th General Assembly of the MGS for Europe and the Middle East, which was attended by about 70 people from 15 different countries, all united by the charism of Don Bosco and Mother Mazzarello for the growth of so many young people across the continent. Present were the General Counselor for Youth Ministry, Father Miguel Angel Garcia Morcuende, and the General Counselor for Youth Ministry of the FMA, Sister Ronita Borja. During the assembly, they were able to reflect on the state of Salesian Youth Movement, Europe, its organization and the next steps to be taken together in the coming years. Ukraine, Episcopal ordination of Salesian Bishop Maxim Ryabuka, celebrated in Kyiv. On 22nd December, in the Patriarchal Cathedral of the Resurrection of Christ in Kyiv, the Episcopal ordination of Maxim Ryabuka, Auxiliary Bishop of the Donetsk Archbishopric Exarchate, was celebrated. The ceremony was presided over by His Beatitude, Sviatoslav Shevchuk, head and father of the Ukraine Greek Catholic Church. It was an important and joyful moment, even in the midst of the ongoing conflicts in the country, which particularly emphasized the commitment of the Salesians to the Church and the Ukrainian people. Inter America, Dominican Republic, 75 years of Salesian presence in Jarabacoa. On 10th December, in the parish of Mary Help of Christians in Jarabacoa, Dominican Republic, a Eucharist of Thanksgiving was celebrated for 75 years of Salesian presence in the city, presided over by Father Victor Pichardo, director of the Salesian community. In addition, on the occasion of the 75th anniversary of the Salesian Presence, Senators, Deputies and the City Council paid tribute to the Sons of Don Bosco for sharing their charism and for the great contribution they have made to the education of children, young people and adolescents of the entire city community. The day of celebration and feasting was then rounded off with the staging of the musical Una casa, un sueno. Guatemala Social Communication Meeting of the Salesian Province of Central America From 28th November to 1st December, the local communicators of the 24 Salesian works of the Central American Province gathered for their annual meeting. The Salesian missionary work in San Pedro, Carcha, was the setting that brought together 40 communicators. The meeting dealt with topics such as the Rector Major's program document, the Global Educational Pact, and a profound reflection on Pope Francis's message for the Day of Social Communications. The time was also used to review the Provincial Social Communication Project and the structure of the local plans for 2023. 
Each Silesian communicator returned to their work with a deeper sense of the network, the family and the Silesian mission. Mediterranean Spain Over 250 participants at the 2022 Campo Bosco of the San Giacomo Maggiore province From 9th to 11th December the Logrono Campo Bosco brought together more than 250 young people between the ages of 16 and 19 The underlying theme motivated the participants inwardly towards others and towards God. During the days, the essential figure of the animator as mediator and companion was particularly emphasized. The event was organized by the Youth Pastoral Delegation with the collaboration of the Federation of Youth Centers of Bosco Taldea and Don Bosco Cantabria. The experience represented a time of simplicity, joy, and believing witness to approach the figure of Jesus. Italy Young people participate in the in the heart of the world, wrote in Turin. On 18th and 19th December, the third meeting of the Nel Cuore del Mondo, in the heart of the world, part was held in Turin for young people with the aim of trying to expand the boundaries of their hearts and minds beyond their comfort zone and try to imagine an economy that is truly at the service of peoples, an economy that is attentive to the good of all. The strongest invitation was to learn to ask oneself in the concreteness of one's own life what can be done to change things and how to have a deeper knowledge of the current international situation and the most worrying crisis currently underway as Don Bosco also did in his time with the boys at Waldoco. Here is what we have prepared for you in this December edition of Ants News Video. Share your news, events and stories and let the rest of the world know about them. We will update you soon with more news and events. Thank you. <laughs>